What's up, Eddie? I hope you're enjoying. And in these videos, we usually cover a few things that you can do to, to improve your rankings on Google. With the hotel, a couple of things are a little different, but we'll go over that. And the three things we're going to cover are content, citations, and backlinks. And we like to start with content first, because I don't know if you've heard that saying that with Google, content is king. And we really recommend having about 1,000 to 1,500 words on the homepage and 500 to 750 words on the back pages. And I've got your website pulled up here, and it's a great looking site. Uh, there's just not a lot of content on here. Good, good looking pictures, but we want a lot more content with keywords in here. And it looks like you're paying someone for, for SEO and to, to develop your website already here. So, um, you know, what you want to do is incorporate keywords and that content into this homepage and the back pages. And we've got a, a competitor pulled up here, um, Hotel Cocal. And you can tell here it's not a great looking site. And we'll go a little bit further into this and see why, you know, that you've got way more content than they do. Um, there is a reason why they're kind of a little bit further ahead. We'll go into that. Jocko VIP over here, they actually have quite a bit of content on here. And, you know, these bold um, letters here, these bold words with uh, the fancy colors in here definitely draw people in. And they've got some good pictures. So they definitely know what they're doing over there as far as getting content on here and getting, you know, um, their reviews and links to their socials down here and just everything kind of popping out at them. Um, it doesn't probably look as great as a as a fancy hotel web page. I don't know what kind of look you're going for, but they're definitely dr trying to draw a certain crowd to come have fun at this hotel, right? So going into a tool we like to use here called Ahrefs, this lets us see what's working well for websites and what's not. And we can see here you've got 172 organic keywords and only 28 clicks a month organically coming to your website. So going over here to um, Hotel Cocal, they've got 487 keywords and 769 uh, traffic coming into their website. And over here at Jocko VIP, they've got 2,400 keywords and 1,100 traffic coming into their website per month organically. So what you want to do here is go in here, do a little research and see what the competition is getting ranked for. As you can tell here, Costa Rica Bachelor Party, uh, Jaco VIP is in the first position for that. And that gets searched for 150 times a month. It's not hard to rank for at all. Keyword difficulty of four. Uh, Jaco Beach, Costa Rica, that gets searched for 2,400 times a month. Uh, a little bit more difficult to rank for, but they're in the first position for all of these. And this is where a lot of their clicks are coming from per month. So um, these are kind of the, the keywords you want to target, Jocko Bachelor Party, and see what's getting the most searches and start incorporating that into your website to really start out ranking these guys. Over here at Cocal, they've got, um, you know, their name is kind of drawing some, um, some traffic to their website. So they've got some name recognition there, which they've got a casino there, which is probably a huge draw. Um, but again, you kind of want to do the research here and see which ones they're, they're ranking for that doesn't include their name and, uh, start targeting those over here. Um, hotel Poseidon, Costa Rica, you're actually in the second position for that, which is your name. So you kind of want to get ahead of there. Um, that's only searched for 50 times a month. It's not hard to rank for. So you should be ranking at the top for that. You're actually ranking here at 14th for a Costa Rica bachelor party. Uh, that gets searched for 150 times a month. Um, and you can definitely start drawing some more traffic in if you start ranking at the top position for that. So going over here, uh, we usually use another tool called WhiteSpark to research citations. And that would be the second thing we cover. But with hotels and in Costa Rica, WhiteSpark actually doesn't uh, research citations in Costa Rica yet. They're working on it. So... Um, it's something that I'm going to do a little bit more research on, but just wanted to show you what the citations are. It's what creates this GMB here. Uh, back in the States, when you type in, you know, pizza in Denver, you'll usually see three or four things pop up in something similar to this. Um, like this area right here, there's usually some ads up top. I typed in hotel in Jaco, Costa Rica. Uh, and then this would be the, the Google Map Pack or GMB. So I'm going to do a little bit more research and see what you could do to get ranked on here. Because as you can tell here, they've got their own ranking system for the hotels here. So um, I got to do a little bit of work and see what actually takes you to the top here. And 
usually you know you would search down here and see where where your hotel is searched but just think about that the last time that you searched for something on google and went past those uh first few um results that came up here on this first location so that's kind of where you want to be and the third thing we want to cover are backlinks and backlinks are links from other websites linking back to your website and it's kind of like a popularity contest with google the more backlinks you have pointed back at you the more relevant your website is and you want to have content that's relevant to yours not all backlinks are created equal you don't necessarily want to have a backlink from uh, a pizza shop or a tire repair shop down there or whatever it might be a mechanic down there you know so um what gets you backlinks are uh citations will sometimes give you backlinks uh commenting on blogs when co with content that's relevant to yours so you know travel industry vacation industry anything like that would help out and having friends link back from their websites that'll also help with bank backlinks as well now going back over here to ahrefs we can see you've got 1300 backlinks uh, your competition over here at Cocall, they've got 14,000 backlinks and 121 referring domains. And over here at Jaco VIP, they've only got 508 backlinks, but 94 referring, referring domains. And it looks like they're working on, on their SEO and really driving it up. Um, so what you want to do here is see where your competition is getting backlinks from. Go after all of those. And then a bunch more so that they can't catch up again those uh, citations those directories will sometimes create backlinks for you um, commenting on blogs with content that's relevant to yours you know TripAdvisor here has created a backlink for them um, so all those things will help one thing i did find out is doing some research is that when people are booking a con uh, sorry a hotel online for 75 percent of people booking vacations do it online now they don't do it through a, a travel agent or anything like that or through a phone it's mostly done online 40 percent of those 75 percent uh book through booking.com if you wouldn't believe it that's quite a bit of that traffic and i looked for your your hotel here both poseidon and trident and seeing you're not listed on booking.com so whatever you can do to get listed on here um you should do it um, because like I said, 40% of those 75% of people are booking through booking.com. So going back to the backlinks here again, you want to make sure you have at least what the competition has and then a bunch more so that they can't catch up. And in closing, we want to recap what we went over. Uh, you want a thousand to 1500 words of unique content with those keywords on this homepage. And then you want to have, you know, 500 to 750 words with content and those keywords on the back pages so um, the next thing citations that's one thing that I'm going to do a little bit more research on for Costa Rica and see what you can do to get listed on this top page here because I think that'll be huge and you can see here four seasons is paying for an ad to be at the top here so there's definitely some traffic as you know um, for the searches for Hotel and Jaco Costa Rica and backlinks you want to have what the competition has and then some get sites that are as, more, as powerful or more powerful linking back to you um, directories will sometimes do that like the trip advisor uh, people listing you on those directories will help uh, getting listed on booking.com will definitely help with that and when people are searching the, for those buyer intent keywords that's what's really driving that power and it's you really want to show Google that you're the authority when someone's searching for a hotel in Jaco, Costa Rica. You want to send them to your website, obviously. So backlinks will really help get you listed on here organically and start driving some traffic to your website. And if you implement these three strategies, you can definitely start outranking the competition on Google. I hope that you found this video informative. And again, feel free to take these tips and share them with, uh, with Costa Rica and SEO that's helping you out right now. And if you want to link up and talk about how I can help you out, uh, I'll look forward to following up with you. Enjoy life down there, brother. I hope you're killing it. And I'll talk to you soon.